Hey Ivan, I'm Arbazi and welcome back to Let's Play XCOM The Long War Beta 14. So, I'm going to continue where I left off, but before I move on, I need some heals. I need to heal up my assault and I might want to heal up bagels too. And I need to reload a bit more. Also, there's still at least one more heavy floater that I didn't kill. So, he's somewhere out there, already activated. I need to kill him first. He might come back to attack me or he might just chill on the other side of the map and attack me when least expected. That's the worst part of having aliens escape before you can kill them. But we'll see. I can move up the ramp with a soldier or two. But I might want to move into cover in that case. Can I do that? Well, I can stay down here for now. And it needs to reload. So I can move and reload. I can move, stand and reload. Juliet can move here. Don will stay where he is. And keep using steady weapon for now. Okay. So reload, reload. And reload. And Overwatch. Actually, I don't think there was any soldier capable of using Overwatch on that turn. Yeah, there's definitely at least one more heavy floater. Possibly two more heavy floaters? I actually kind of lost track. But I think there are two heavy floaters. Might be wrong, but we'll see. So... Right, where's Carl? There he is. He will go first, in case there's a heavy floater on Overwatch. Which is definitely a possibility. Annette next. Sen can move into cover or something. Juliet can move up and overwatch. And let's keep moving. There's very little cover around here. Okay, I'll move Arpita. Need to wait for her to finish that move. Okay, steady weapon. And overwatch. So, where's that heavy floater? I don't want to chase it across the entire map because I... Oh, there he is! But anyway, I don't want to chase aliens across the map because I would just end up triggering more groups. There are at least three more groups in this mission, I would say. There are over 40 aliens in this mission. I don't think I killed more than 20, 25. So, there should be at least three more groups in here. Anyway, there's the floater. Let's just kill him. I'll use precision shot, because why not? And the problem is that one of these groups will have an ethereal, because I know there's an ethereal in this mission. The hyperwave relay told me as much. Alright, let's try to get a kill on someone who actually needs it. So, who is that going to be? Juliet, maybe? Okay, Juliet, that's a kill. Nice. So, one more heavy floater? Possibly? Oh, that was actually a promotion. Awesome. Alright, let's move on then. Don will stay where he is for now. Or maybe not. Yeah, I'll have to move him. Okay. He can move on the next turn. Alright. I'll just move through this room. I know there's nothing inside, so... That will give me some cover at least. Bagels should reload. So, reload... Annette should reload. I'll just use this turn for reloads. Ten can position next to the force field. There might be some aliens in this general area. That's usually the case on this map. Because that area is just huge. It's also a death trap. It's very, very easy to get flanked over there. If you're not careful. And you don't really have a lot of options. That's the problem with this UFO in general. It's so easy to get flanked here. And you really don't have a lot of options. Which is why I kind of prefer to stay outside as long as possible. But then, there's very little cover outside. So that's also not great. Okay, move and reload again. And I can open that force field on the next turn. Annette can go here. You can stay in the back. Bagel's in the front. Carl can stay where he is. Arpita inside. Anyone else? Reload, Overwatch. 
I'll open the force field on the next turn. I'm mostly worried about that ethereal. Ethereals are no joke. But as I said, there are badly three more groups in this mission. So I don't even think... Oh, there's the heavy floater. But I was going to say, I don't even think I'm halfway done. And grenade. Only three damage, that's not too bad. Okay, he's going to die now. I can shoot with most of my squad. Just need to open that force field first. Surprise! So I got two shots with Sen. That will give me holo targeting too. Nice. Let's do some damage with bagels. And then try to get a kill on someone who actually needs experience. Juliet could try to get another kill. Wait, she already got a promotion, didn't she? Yes, she did. So Sen can get another kill maybe. That's a kill. Nice. Okay, now I can move on. But I'm going to fight outside of the UFO. And considering there are at least three more groups, some of them are probably patrols. So... Yeah, I'm moving back outside. But reload first. No more reloads necessary, okay. I'll have a peek around this area, but yeah, I'm not seeing any groups here. Okay, Overwatch. There's still a Mectoid in this mission though, at least. I think that's a Mectoid and not a Sectopod. Oh yeah, Sen should probably reload though. I can almost send where Arpita is. Sure. So you can go here, then reload, and I'm going to move back outside. So this way I suppose. As for Don, where do I want him? On the roof maybe? But getting line of sight might be problematic. What is he? Did he already move this turn? I guess he did. Okay, Juliet then. Move next to that forest field. Annette, Carl, I'll move Carl a bit. Okay, Overwatch. I can still hear more floaters, I think. I'm pretty sure I heard a floater for a moment. I suppose that's not very surprising, considering there are like 20 aliens left in this mission easily. So what about Don? I could position him up here. He probably won't get line of sight, but I can just move down on the next turn. Or I can toggle flight. Okay, we're going this way. Sen can move here. And... Annette can go here. You can go here, somewhere. Maybe. Orders confirmed on the move. And Overwatch. It looks like there's a group this way. But I'm not sure if it's inside the UFO or outside. We'll find out. So what about Don? I could move him all the way down here, which is not a terrible idea. Because if there's a group... Over here, for example, don't won't get line of sight. Yeah, he definitely won't have line of sight. It's probably better to move him then. This will take a turn or two, but I'm okay with that. Juliet can move a bit closer. And Overwatch. I'm not in a huge rush. When I don't have that many more medkits left, so I need to be careful about the damage I take. And there's still an ethereal somewhere in here. That ethereal could be in any of these groups. He doesn't have to be with the command pod. He can be with any group. So this next group might have an ethereal. That's certainly not impossible. In fact, it wouldn't really surprise me, which is why I want to move on. 
He's supposed to kill the ethereal, that's his job with precision shot. I'll just keep using Overwatch for two more turns. Because I want to have steady weapon active. Okay, steady weapon. Any more reloads? No. Okay, Overwatch then. And now I can move on my next turn. There's definitely a group this way, that's kind of obvious. That is the closest group. And I'm very close to the zone wall. That group can't be far away. In fact, if I move with bagels now, I will probably see it. Maybe. Well, I expect to see it. No? What? Interesting. This is kind of awkward. But let's keep moving. I can jump down with a soldier or two. Okay, you can go. Who else? Sen can stay where she is. Annette can jump down. Juliet can stay... Oh, what? What? Are you serious right now? Come on. Wow, that was a troll group. Is that a full group of heavy floaters? Certainly looks that way. But seriously? They were all hugging the friggin' UFO? Are you kidding me? That was the biggest troll group I've ever seen. Like, legitimately, the biggest troll group. And that's yet another full group of heavy floaters. How many heavy floaters does this mission have? Like, 30? Great. Well, this is going to be tough to deal with. Yeah. I do have the flamethrower, but I can't really use it. Yeah, it's not worth using a flamethrower to hit one heavy floater. No, definitely not. So what exactly can I do? I can take a shot. Okay, 8 damage. I would like to kill at least one heavy floater. Problem is, I can't even use telekinetic field. There's not a lot of cover around here that I can use. Precision shot now. Okay, precision shot on this guy. 18 damage. Great, I'm getting trolled. Constantly. And now that heavy floater is down to one hit point. Fantastic. Great. Well, Sen can't hunker down, so I might as well take another shot. Because I don't have any other options. At least I got a nice crit there. But one hit point, really? How is that reasonable in any way, shape or form? It definitely isn't. I'm a little bit worried about grenades. And missed twice. That was a terrible turn for me. I could use flash, but I need to get line of sight. I'm giving them an awesome grenade target by doing this. Only 21%. Uh, okay, that's a kill. Okay. I do have disabling shot. I will probably use it. What else can I do? Megals has rapid fire, so I could use that. He already moved, so rapid fire is the only way to shoot twice. Shoot twice at this guy? Probably. And then the other heavy floaters might target bagels instead of moving towards me and throwing a grenade. Alright, let's take that shot. I think that's a kill. Yep, that had to be a crit then. Okay, nice. Now, spread out a bit. I still got disabling shot. I'm going to use it. This looks like the squad leader. Mayhem, bombard. Okay. What about this? 69, 29. Bombard. Okay, this one doesn't have mayhem. Don't miss. That's important. There we go. That one is disabled. What else can I do? Not a whole lot. I need to move our pit out of the way. Okay, move in here. And Overwatch. Yep. Okay, Overwatch. I'm a little bit worried about this group. But hopefully the other heavy floaters will target the bagels. They can't actually see this group. Okay, one is incoming. He can see the group now. 
That's not the disabled one, is it? No. He's shooting bagels. I'm okay with that. He actually missed bagels. <laughs> oh, that was a fourth heavy floater. Right. No, he's suppressing bagels. That's even better. I don't really care about that part. Five heavy floaters here. Seriously, that was an insane group. Okay. Bagels can tank some damage. That's acceptable. And that's the last shot. Okay, he's fine. Now, how many can I kill on this turn? That's a good question. I could try Psy Panic with Annette. She should have pretty high chance to succeed with it. I can use Rapid Fire and Run and Gun. Move over here, maybe. Move here and then target the Heavy Floater. I'm going to use Run and Gun for sure. Hmm. Okay, let's move here. I don't think there's any heavy floater on Overwatch, no. So, 63% might be good to get holo targeting first before I take that shot. The only person with holo targeting is Sen. And I can only shoot once with Sen on this turn. Alright, I'm doing it. Okay, holo targeting. Now I can use rapid fire with my assault. I'm also considering using kinetic, a telekinetic field. Okay, take this shot. Missed. And 7 damage only. Great. That wasn't a very good rapid fire. I'm just saying. So, bagels, Annette. This is going to be tough. If I panic, 52% chance. That's not too bad. I still want to kill this guy though. Rapid fire with Juliet. I want to spread out, but there's not enough cover around here. I could move Arpita out of the way, but is Juliet close enough to take her place? Yes. So move Arpita out of the way, like so. And then I can move Juliet where Arpita was and use rapid fire. To target that heavy floater. Okay, only 42%, but I'm taking that shot. Please hit at least once. Missed twice, great. This was a really awful turn for me. So, bagels. If I want to shoot twice, I can't move. Let's take a shot then. Okay, that's a kill. At least bagels got a crit. That makes up for all the misses that I just had. Now I can try Psy Panic. I still got done. But Psy Panic with Carl. I do have Psy Panic on Annette, but then I would have to give up Telekinetic Field. Hmm, interesting choice. Let's try Psy Panic. That's 52%. Fingers crossed. I need this to work. And it worked. Okay, nice. Now I could try to. Use Psy Panic on one more Heavy Floater, or I can use Telekinetic Field. Tough choice. Really tough choice. I can try Psy Panic, I suppose. Move on it here, and then use Psy Panic. I'm not sure about that. Maybe. Okay, let's try Psy Panic. No, no, my, not mine, Frey. Target is already panicked. Why was it grayed out? 25%, 25%. This was the squad leader with Mayhem, right? Yeah, it was. I'm not sure why some panic was grayed out. It worked. Okay, so... I got two heavy floaters that aren't panicking. I'll start shooting them then. 89%. Let's take that shot. Six damage. Not amazing. Take a shot with bagels? Yeah. I want them to shoot bagels, not anyone else. I don't want them to move towards me. Because Sen is only using partial cover, that's not amazing. Let's just take another shot. That's 60%. And it's a hit, eight damage, okay. That was a very weird turn. I still got Arpita. 
Overwatch. This is still going to be tough. I need to kill these two heavy floaters and then, and then kill the two that are panicking. Preferably while they are still panicking. So, will they move towards me? No, they are shooting bagels. Perfect. That's exactly what I wanted. And this one is shooting bagels too, and they both missed. Okay, well, that was the best case scenario for me. Don is almost out of ammunition, unfortunately. About 99% chance. Okay, 7 damage. Decent. Now he's out of ammunition. So, yeah. Juliet. Only one target, but I can move. Sen. Okay, this guy and this guy. 71%. That might be a kill. Yep, that's a kill. Good. I do have double tap on this turn. Yes. Let's get holo targeting up. I should be able to kill both on this turn, maybe. Or maybe not. What about my assault? These two heavy floaters should be panicked for at least one more turn easily. So it's safe to move like this. Okay, I need to hit at least once. Go, go, go. Awesome, 17 crit. The second one missed, but I'm not even mad. Bagels can finish the job, hopefully. Come on, Bagels. 63%. And that's a kill. Good. Going well. But this mission had just an insane amount of heavy floaters. Seriously? This is not done yet. 72%. And I can shoot twice. One more. 22% again. Okay, two hits. Nice one. I can actually get a kill if I hit. Eight damage. Come on. Now, I need three more damage. Carl can do it. I'm not going to use flash because that's not guaranteed free damage. Arpita can take a shot. She has decent aim. Not amazing, but 30%? Chance to hit? No, missed. Hey, I tried. Carl, 41%. And that's a miss again. And Don is out of ammunition. Bagels is also out of ammunition. So reload. Should be easy to finish it on the next turn. But I think I have to finish it on this turn. Which means Don won't be able to do any more damage. I'll just move and reload. Okay, move and reload. So, let's see. I can flank that heavy floater if I want to. I can flank him and use rapid fire with bagels. That's probably the most damage bagels can do on this turn. Assuming he will hit. Okay, let's do it. I will reveal some of the fog. Hopefully I won't trigger anything. I didn't. 100% and 80% chance to crit. Let's make it happen. 15 crit, good. One more. And that's a kill. Awesome. So that group is done. This will be an easy kill. And that's a kill for Sen. Nice. I hope I killed all the heavy floaters in this mission now. <laughs> because seriously, that was just insane. If I see another full group of heavy floaters, I'm just going to snap or something. Okay, well, Overwatch. I need some reloads. Do I need any heals? I think I'm good. Did I even take any damage there? Other than Bagels taking some hits. I might want to heal Bagels, actually. Maybe. I think so. I can get him almost back to full health. Let's heal Bagels. He's supposed to be the one tanking the damage here. And I still got how many more medkits? Not that many, actually. Six more. I have one medkit on Annette. And one medkit on Ho. I had one more extra medkit, I think. Oh yeah, Don has an extra medkit. Okay. So let's heal by girls. But I'm going to finish this part here and continue in next one. 
Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this episode, please consider leaving a like. And I'll see you next time.